Thank you so much. Did you sign this for me? I'm going to sign it out. <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, Marshall. Thank you. It's very good to see you. Yeah, it's good to see you here in the wine person. <laughs> <laughs> what happens with the people I coach is they tend to get lost in achievement. Mm. And they become addicted to achievement. They believe if I achieve more, I will be happy. Mm. If I achieve more, my life will be meaningful. And they never get that. You know, the Buddhist term is the hungry ghost. Mm. <laughs> Always eating, but never full. Mm. And so. What I try to teach people is never place your value as a person as only on the result. So, because number one, you don't control the results. Mm. But two, what happens after you achieve it? More, 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 more. Yeah, it never stops. It's that contentment of having enough versus the desire to keep wanting more, more, more. Well, that's a very good point. You can enjoy the process mm. of life, which is learning and growing. Yeah. On the other hand, that doesn't mean you're addicted to the outcomes of what you do. Mm -hmm. So the key is just don't become addicted to the outcomes of what you do. If you do, you never win. I gave an example there. My signed my book, Albert mm -hmm. Berlitz, the old Pfizer. Yeah. How'd he do last year? We came up with a cure for COVID. Mm -hmm. That's nice. Company's yeah. stock is high or never. Mm -hmm. Employee engagement is high, CEO of the year, blah, yeah. blah, blah. So I ask him, what's your problem? Is it <laughs> next year? Mm -hmm. If his value as a human being is he has to do better than last year, mm -hmm. he gets a goodbye. Yeah. Michael Phelps won 25 gold medals. Mm -hmm. What do you think about doing after he won his last gold medal? Mm -hmm. Killing himself. Wow. What? He was addicted to achievement. Mm -hmm. And if you don't enjoy the process of life, you can achieve all you want to achieve. Mm -hmm. It's not going to make you happy. Mm -hmm. So one of the things I talked about today is uh, happiness and achievement are independent variables. Sure. It's great to achieve. Mm -hmm. To achieve. Mm -hmm. It's great to be happy. To mm -hmm. happy. Yeah. Never believe happy. Achievement mm -hmm. is going to make you happy. Yeah. It won't. Mm -hmm. So I think you know it's very important. We have been brought up to believe that once I get something, it's all yeah. going to be okay. Mm -hmm. The great Western art form goes like this. You may have seen one before. Yeah. It's a drama. Uh huh. The most common Western art form. There's a drama. There's a person, mm -hmm. and they're sad. Very sad. Mm -hmm. They spend money. Mm -hmm. They buy a product, and they become happy. <laughs> This is called a commercial. Have you ever seen one of these? Yeah. How many million times? Over and over. Yeah. And the message is always to say, happiness is out there. Mm. Mm. Happiness is not out there. Mm. There's nothing you're going to buy that's going to make you any happier. Mm. Yeah. And when death is in your face, you start questioning what's important. Mm. I like that. Yeah. That's a good word, eh, Marshall? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm a Buddhist. Mm. And Buddha was brought up uh, very wealthy. Mm -hmm. His father was a king. He was protected from life. He was able to sneak out of his bubble three mm -hmm. times. Where did he learn? First, you get old. Mm. Second, people get sick. And third, you die. Mm. Old, sick, die. Mm. You can have all the money in the world. Old, sick, die. No <laughs> money. Old, sick, die. Mm. It's going to happen. He learned, I can never be happy with more. Mm. He goes out in the woods and starves himself. Mm. You know what he learned? Can't be happy with less. Mm. What did he finally realize one night? Never be happy with more. Mm. Never be happy with less. Mm. There's only one thing I can ever be happy with, what I have. Mm. There's only one time I could ever be happy, now. Mm. There's only one place I can ever be happy, here. Mm. That's it. See, what mm. happens is, and it's almost in your question, Yeah. there's this kind of thing that once mm. you get to this place, mm. you don't need to coach anymore, mm. you don't need to learn anymore, mm. you're there. Mm. There is no there. Mm. There's no there. Mm. It's start over every day. Yeah. You're not going to get to some place where you're perpetually mm. in bliss. Mm. There's no such place. Mm. Every minute you start over, every breath you start over. That's mm. it. It's hard enough. There's one book that ends with the phrase, and they lived happily ever after. Mm -hmm. That book is called a fairy tale. <laughs> <laughs> the thing that comes to my mind is how happiness can very often begin with gratitude. Right. Grateful for what we have, grateful for being in and out for that breath, and right. suddenly you realize how abundant life actually is. It is, and that's not easy. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. That's, 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 the, that's the journey of life. <laughs> <laughs> yes, very good. Mm. Fantastic. Marshall, great to meet you in person. Yeah? Thank, Thank you so much. So